Hi, welcome to Just Trading. In this video, our team give you an analysis with the information we got after the closing date time of May 28, 2020. Our objective is to give you suggestions to trade with less risk and higher capital return. Remember to stop the video at any time, if you want to look at it carefully. Here, we show you an example of the stock's timestamp that you can find on the video's comments. You can click on the timestamp and go to the stock's details. SP500 ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Dow Jones Industrial ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. NASDAQ 100 ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Corporate bond ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the market sectors table. There is a weak opportunity to buy energy sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected buyer return of 1.3%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $39.66. For call option, a possible call price is at $1.13. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell real estate sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 3.7%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $33.57. For put option, a possible put price is at $1.42. Energy sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of energy sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Schlumberger Limited. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.4%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $18.57. For put option, a possible put price is at $1.17. Financial sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock stable of financial sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Morgan Stanley. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 9.8%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $43.15. For put option, a possible put price is at $1.18. Citigroup Incorporated was a previous top seller alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Citigroup Incorporated is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 8.5%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.5%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $47.98. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $51.4. On the put option table, Citigroup Incorporated has a striking price at $51. For this option, the actual put price is at $2.78, but we expect a possible put price at $1.82. Wells Fargo is a strong sell suggestion. It is on a bull low class. In the past, 
our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 2.5%. You may expect now a sell return of 6.3%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $25.67, but we expect a possible sell price of $27.96. In addition, we suggest to stop selling Wells Fargo, if it is over 0.45% of your stock price trade. On the put option table, Wells Fargo has a striking price at $28. For this option, the actual put price is at $1.27, but we expect a possible put price at $0.81. Real estate sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of real estate sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Simon Property Group. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 11.8%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $56.7. For put option, a possible put price is at $6.63. Prologis was a previous top seller alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Prologis is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 8.5%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.2%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $90.52, but we expect a possible buy price of $90.09. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $94.83. On the put option table, Prologis has a striking price at $96. For this option, the actual put price is not available, but we expect a possible put price at $2.86. Healthcare sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of healthcare sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell United Health Group. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 3.1%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $292.75. For put option, a possible put price is at $5.98. Abbey Incorporated was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Abbey Incorporated is a trade low class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of 4.4%. You may expect now a buy return of 1.8%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $91.84. But we expect a possible sell price of $92.43. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $89.92. On the call option table, Abbey Incorporated has a striking price at $88. For this option, the actual call price is at $3.14, but we expect a possible call price at $2.57. Industrial sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of industrial sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. United Parcel Service is a strong sell suggestion. It is on a bull normal class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 2.9%. You may expect now a sell return of 1.0%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $97.71.
but we expect a possible sell price of $100.22. In addition, we suggest to stop selling United Parcel Service. If it is over 1.80% of your stock price trade. On the put option table, United Parcel Service has a striking price at $101. For this option, the actual put price is at $2.46. But we expect a possible put price at $2.08. Material Sector ETF was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Material Sector ETF is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 1.2%. You may expect now a sell return of 3.1%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $53.77. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $56. On the put option table, Material Sector ETF has a striking price at $56. For this option, the actual put price is not available. But we expect a possible put price at $1.42. Let's look at the stocks table of Material Sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Ecolab Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 5.4%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $200.48. For put option, a possible put price is at $5.52. Sherwin Williams was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Sherwin Williams is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 1.3%. You may expect now a sell return of 0.3%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $586.75, but we expect a possible buy price of $581.07. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $588.85. On the put option table, Sherwin Williams has a striking price at $605. For this option, the actual put price is at $19.5. But we expect a possible put price at $11.28. Discretionary sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock's table of discretionary sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy Walt Disney Company. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 2.8%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $120.13. For call option, a possible call price is at $3.13. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Nike Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 0.8%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $97.24. For put option, a possible put price is at $2.84. McDonald's was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that McDonald's is a trade normal class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of 9.9%. You may expect now a buy return of 1.3%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $191.01. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $186.69. On the call option table, McDonald's has a striking price at $185. For this option, the actual call price is at $4.78 but we expect a possible call price at $3.29. Consumer Staples ETF is a strong sell suggestion. It is on a bull high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 0.6%. 
you may expect now a sell return of 1.4%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $58.92, but we expect a possible sell price of $59.63. In addition, we suggest to stop selling consumer staples ETF. If it is over 2.85% of your stock price trade. On the put option table, consumer staples ETF has a striking price at $60. For this option, the actual put price is at $0.95. But we expect a possible put price at $0.56. Let's look at the stock's table of staples sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Philip Morris. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 5.8%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $72. For put option, a possible put price is at $1.57. Technology sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of technology sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy Western Digital. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 11.8%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $44.44. For call option, a possible call price is at $2.01. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Texas Instruments. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.7%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $115.82. For put option, a possible put price is at $2.09. NVIDIA Corporation is a mild buy suggestion. It is on a trade low class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 5.1%. You may expect now a buy return of 2.8%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $342.34 but we expect a possible buy price of $333.47. In addition, we suggest to stop buying NVIDIA Corporation, if it is below 2.95% of your stock price trade. On the call option table, NVIDIA Corporation has a striking price at $330. For this option, the actual call price is at $15.15, but we expect a possible call price at $11.51. communication sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of communication sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Comcast Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 3.5%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $39.07. For put option, a possible put price is at $0.87. Comcast Corporation was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Comcast Corporation is a bull high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 3.0%. You may expect now a sell return of 3.5%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $38.14. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $41.54. On the put option table, Comcast Corporation has a striking price at $41. For this option, the actual put price is at $1.71 but we expect a possible put price at $0.87. T-Mobile US was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that T-Mobile US is a trade low class. 
In the past, it has given an average buy return of 3.6%. You may expect now a buy return of 2.9%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $102.36. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $96.03. On the call option table, T-Mobile US has a striking price at $95. For this option, the actual call price is at $4.75 but we expect a possible call price at $2.47. Utility Sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of utility sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Nextera Energy. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 5.6%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $238.6. For put option, a possible put price is at $7.44. This ends the analysis of our team that gives you a good start on your trading day. Please, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Share it and leave it a like if you find it useful. Thanks for following us. We hope to see you on our next Just Trading video. Bye.